Hello everyone, my name is Robert Christian, but you can call me Robbie for short, and today I want to show you this amazing spreadsheet that will help you keep track of your photo decks progress in new Pokemon Snap. I found this document when I was casually scrolling through Reddit, which I barely use, by the way, I don't really understand how that app works, and I saw this post from user Calamity Code on the new Pokemon Snap subreddit that said, Hi all! Out of boredom, I spent 15 hours making a huge, mostly automated Excel tracker for new Pokemon Snap. All you have to type in are your photo scores. If anyone's interested, I'm almost done and can share it in the next day or two. Of course, I commented I was interested. I love lists. I'm sorry that I'm weird. <laughs> and share they did, because that spreadsheet is done so professionally that all you need to do is input your photo deck scores and it will do all the work for you. I know Microsoft Excel can be very intimidating, and while this whole thing sounds complicated, it's actually really simple. I'll explain using my math nerd skills. I have a copy downloaded and already filled out on my computer with my own scores, but I'll open a new document to give you a better idea of how it works. This Photodex tracker not only keeps track of your scores to be redundant, but other stats as well, like how many Pokemon you registered, your best scoring photo, your worst scoring photo, how many total diamond ranked photos you've taken, etc. You will need to spend some time in game to search up all of your scores and type them in individually, but that's the only work you need to do. The spreadsheet will automatically fill the rest of the information until it eventually looks something like mine. Currently, my highest scoring page is of Archeops with 18,325 points. It even cleverly safeguards against spoilers. Illumina Pokemon, which are central to the plot, mythical and legendary Pokemon, are completely hidden. The tracker won't show the species name until you actually register a score for them. This goes for research requests as well, which you can also keep track of if that's something you'd like to work on. The check marks for these only work on the desktop version of Microsoft Excel, as the mobile and online versions don't support forms as of yet. Everything is color coded and organized by research site, so you can better figure out what levels and photo text entries need more attention. I do wish there was a way to sort Pokemon by name, which in my opinion would make searching for a specific Pokemon even easier. This is quite frankly a great tool to have on hand. You can easily look up what Pokemon you've had to register and start snapping pictures without having to tediously scroll through your Pokedex every single time, which saves so much time. You can download this Photodex tracker using the link in my description. And feel free to contact Calamity Code on Reddit if you have any questions. And thank you again to Calamity Code for graciously allowing me to share this knowledge with the world. Leave a like to help the algorithm, tell me in the comments below how close you are to completing your Photodex, and subscribe for more fun Pokemon videos. Bye!